Hi everyone. In this video, we'll see how to type uh, multiple integrals like double integral and triple integral, and of course until the fourth integral. So let's get started. So I have me uh, here with my uh, Tech Studio. Uh, of course, LaTeX is installed in it. Oh yeah, I think this is not required. I have my article class over here, and I have my begin document and end document as usual. It's just simply a section which is having the title of typing multiple integration. That's all I have. So if I compile this, and this is all it gives. Now suppose if you want to type a double integration, then first of all let's type the single integration what was there in the thumbnail. Uh, if you notice that, this is simply integral f of x dx. So recall that we have done this in the previous tutorial. Begin equation, end equation. And inside the begin equation and end equation, it is simply i and t, and then f of x dx. Right? That's all. So that was the single integration. So if you compile this and you get the single integration over here, maybe probably I will zoom it a little more further. So that's how it is. Now, if you want to type a double integration in a similar fashion, remember in the uh, there is a difference between typing two integrations together and typing a double integration itself. So if I wanted, then I can choose to write it like this: slash int and slash int and f of x. I'm sorry f of x comma y dx dy or simply dr and compile this and you get the double integration over here but what i'm showing here is a slightly different so let me type one more term here slash begin equation and end equation let me zoom out a bit low a little bit so that it, everything fits into single plane now instead of typing int int I'm going to use a package called AMS Math and which offers a double integration right away. So if I type slash use package package AMS Math, remember so far I didn't need the any packages. Now I need a package called AMS Math. And inside my begin equation and end equation, if I type slash instead of int, if I type i i i n t and then write the same thing for example f of x comma y and dr if i compile this i get a slightly different integration over here look at this this is not same as that of what i have typed here so this is a double integration and this is two integrations two single integrations over here whatever i have it so when i want to know it's a double integration now you know that the double integration itself will have a region as a limit so if i have I I N T and then simply type underscore capital R and compile this and that gives a limit for complete R here. So as usual, if you want that R that R to be below this uh, complete double integration itself, then you can choose to write slash limits just before start writing your limits. So if I compile this and that gives uh, R exactly middle of these two integrals, right? That's all. Mm -hmm. So if I wanted, I can actually choose to write something non, something like x square uh, plus y square uh, less than or equal to 1. So if I want to integrate it around the unit disk, I can do that so by writing like this. Notice that accordingly your f of x comma y has been actually kept it inside and this region also has been kept it right away. Right? Uh, so that's about typing a double integration over two integrations over here so that's an advantage so let me take off these things which you need not, not, which we don't need it right now and similar fashion we can also type the triple integration as you might have guessed instead of two i's over here i'm going to type three i's there that's all so it's similarly begin equation and slash end equation and inside the equation block i write slash i i i n t triple i n t and if I simply compile this, you will notice what this is offering. And this is offering a triple integration. Again, uh, triple integration usually is a solid. So we write under, underscore v, f of x comma y comma z, and then dv. And if I compile this, I get triple integral over v, f of x comma y comma z dv. Again, this V, if you wanted that to be uh, below this triple integration to denote it, just uh, before this uh, underscore, write slash I -A -L -I -M, uh, slash limits. That's what I mean. And notice that this V is exactly in the middle of these three double in, uh, triple integrals. Uh, so to denote that these are all called as a triple integration over a volume, 
or over a solid actually right uh, that's all about it so how far we can go uh, up to four integrals you can go if i simply copy this and paste it down and if i instead of writing three i's if i write one more i and this still actually works as it is and gives me a four integrals but if i write one more i means if i want to write a fifth integral of course obviously this text studio started showing is a reddish mark and does not actually exist so if i compile also it gives you the error that undefined control sequence uh, which means uh, ams math offers until four integrals to be written in a manner correct that's all so i hope uh, that's all about this video and i'll see you in the next video with uh, another mathematics trick thank you for watching uh, please uh, consider to subscribe my channel for any other videos thank you